Hey, it says BA1. Right now, you rocking with Refuse Media. She get it going when she tips you off that liquor. Told her bend it over, girl, shake it like a What's happening with it, man? For those who don't know, I go by the name Top Shelf Jock, man. I'm sitting with a South Central artist, man. I go by the name SBA1, man. What's happening with it, man? We're going to kick off the interview, man. How you get the name SBA1? First of all, SB, that's just, that's straight up my name. Straight up, straight down. Government. Can't get the government, but you feel me? On top, on top. All right, and how long you been doing music? Shit, for like, long as I can remember, honestly, like... Nigga been trying to do it ever since, but it was just about getting that gateway to get into it, you feel me? But other than that, nigga been writing music ever since I can remember, you feel me? Trying to get into it. All right, for sure, for sure, for sure. So you just dropped that uh, situation ship. That's hard. Uh, for the fans that don't know, when, what can they expect from that situation ship? Man, it's just, it's a real versatile project. It's just like uh, about like situation ships straight up. Like, you feel me? Relationships, what you deal with, and you feel me? Like the goods, the bads. Ups and downs of a relationship, so feel me that's straight up. They drop Valentine's Day though, you could go get it. Coming to iTunes soon. All time, all time. All right, as you know, I'm gonna tell you like I tell everybody else. My interview is about who you are as a person, as well as what you got coming up. So you know, let them know what you like to eat. What's your favorite food? <laughs> oh man, <laughs> nigga like food, shit. Uh, off the top. Uh, Mexican food, from tacos, enchiladas, all that type of shit, that type of get out. Uh, my mama cooking, period, you feel me? Fried chicken, all that shit, you feel me? You still gonna get that plate, you feel me, before you get up out of here, but... Shit, that's pretty much it. For sure, for sure. Shit. Y'all heard he said, man, mom's in there cooking, man. They, you know, they heard he said they gonna feed your boy before I get up out of here. That's what's up, man. All right, man, coming up, man, I know you come from music and shit, you know, your family. What's uh, what's some of the best advice you've been ever been given, man? You know, just like the, the best advice. Oh, man, that's a hard one. Nigga been giving a lot of advice from a lot of different people, you feel me? So that's a real tough one, but shit. Don't give up. Just stay on your shit, you feel me? Nigga, you got to get that shit for yourself because ain't, ain't nobody going to do it for you, you feel me? Here you go. Top, good answer. For sure, man. All right, you know what it is, you know, in the time of today, growing up being a young black man, you know, especially in America, uh, if you could be president, you know, for a day, you know, if you could just have that power, what's one thing you would do? Like, what's the first thing you would do if you could be president? If I could be president. God damn. Oh, man. Shit, take care of the black people, man. Change the police. Like, let me get good cops in there, you feel me? Like, it's a whole lot of corrupt shit going on within the police force and you feel me, government, so just probably get that shit straight, you feel me? Yeah, I'm all for Good answer. You know, speaking of, uh, speaking of that, growing up, you know, what type of student was you, you know? If, even if you, you know, whether you went to school or not, what type of student was you? Ooh, man, up and probably to, like, middle school, a nigga was a real good student, like, you feel me? Like, A and B type nigga, like, all my shit, bro. After that, once I start wanting to, you know, like, get into the music, it was just like, shit, I'm, I'm going for this, you feel me? I don't need no, you feel me, no college degree for music, you feel me? And it's my passion, so, you feel me? I just felt like, shit, fuck it, but, you feel me? I did all my high school shit, don't get me wrong. I just, I ain't do no college or nothing like that, you feel me? Yeah. On top, he said he put his good foot forth with the music. All right, so for sure, uh, so what do, what do you love about being a, a rapper, a musician, you know what I'm saying? What do you love about it the most? Being creative about it, you feel me? Like, nigga mixing all that, you feel me? So, like, that's the fun part of it, you feel me? Coming up with the lyrics, you feel me? Coming up with the catchy hook, though, you feel me? That's the fun part of it, so. Probably just that, but besides that, like, the response from the fans, you feel me? That'd be, like, dope, you feel me? To see people rocking with you, you feel me? And shit like that, so. Probably that, too. <laughs> shit, well, you know. Being from L.A., man, I'm a Lakers fan, and you know we got the Rams coming back, so I don't know what I'm going to do with football, but uh, what's some of your, you know, what's your favorite team? Uh, shit, I'm a Lakers fan, straight up, you feel me? My whole life, you feel me? The whole dynasty, the three-peat, the whole, you feel me? I'm a, uh, I got to get to a Lakers game for Kobe Lee, you feel me? But, uh, shit, football, Patriots, straight up Patriots, baseball, Dodgers, you feel me? I don't really fuck with hockey, but Kings, you feel me? Like, shit like that, you feel me? So, LA nigga. Yeah, off top. Coming up, did you have any other jobs or anything? Any, you know, any other means of getting paper, you know, before music? Oh, yeah. Man, nigga was working at Taco Bell for a cool minute, you feel me? Like, Taco Bell is a joint, uh, park recreation. 
You feel me? Besides that, I didn't really have no job. It was just music, you feel me? But nigga had jobs and shit, tried to do that shit the right way, but minimum wage ain't enough. That shit ain't cutting it, you feel me? So, you know? Oh, God. For real. All right, so we talked about how you was, you know, at, at coming up as a student and shit. If you could speak to your younger self in them times, like, if you could speak to yourself as a high school student, what's some advice you would tell yourself? Oh, man, shit. Stay in the books. Oh, God, like, I honestly wish I stayed in the books just so I could have more options. You feel me? But it's, it's solid, though. You feel me? But probably just stay in the books. If I was talking to the high school me, like, but besides that, just stay on your shit. You feel me? Keep grinding. Don't let nobody tell you no type shit. You feel me? Oh God, go for what you want. Top. All right, so uh, you know, making music, you know, I know this. You got catalog. What do you think? Uh, what you think the realest shit you ever wrote? Like your realest pen to pad. The realest shit I ever wrote. Dear Mama. Song I wrote. Uh, shout out to No No Good Fat Box. You feel me? Uh, on the hook and on the uh, you feel me? The first verse, whatever. But oh God, that's probably the realest joint I wrote so far. Yeah. On SoundCloud. Let's check it out. On God, on SoundCloud. Sure. <coughs> All right, man. So before I let you get up out of here, man, I got to get you with, you know, what I get everybody with. What's your top five rappers? <laughs> top five. Man, the greats go without say. The Jay-Z, the Pac, the Biggie. You feel me? That go without say. But shit, right now, probably like Wale, J. Cole. You feel me? Shit. Uh, KS. Free Killer, by the way. EML, everything, nigga. Uh, Reno, you feel me? That's my dog, you feel me? One of my favorite artists. Uh, last probably go, gotta go with like Nip or Dom, you feel me? But either way, this is the whole West, you feel me? Period. That's what I'm fucking with, you feel me? The whole I Am Sue, the RJ, you feel me? All that shit, but you feel me? That's my top five, though, on God. Yeah. For sure, good answer. I like that. Well, you know, let them know where they can find you, man. You know, social media, internet, anything like that. Let them know. Oh, shit. Instagram. At SBA1 underscore EML, uh, Twitter EML underscore SB, either or, you feel me? All right, there it is, man. Like we said, I'm Top Shelf Jock. This is SB straight out of South Central, man. There it is. Refuse Media. So I'm rolling with my Curtis. Me, Killer T, Fly and Bony Tony. EML, girl. EML, SB, bitch, you know me. Fuck it once, then I pass it to the homies. Say your bitch bad, bet mine better. And to get up on my level, niggas need a ladder And she say she got a nigga, that don't even matter Cause I be with you for now, my other bitches after